Hello beautiful people from the internet, it is Connie over here and today I have a funny goofy story to tell you guys, alright? Today as I'm gonna be smoking my Marlboro Gold, which is right here, I'm gonna be telling you guys the story on how I found out how you could get the biggest cigarette buzz, but I found that out by mistake. So let's light this up, this is gonna be a funny one, let's go and enjoy it, cheers! So a while ago I started smoking like almost two years ago now somewhat in the between of that like in the first two or three months i didn't even have a channel yet at this point i was just watching jacob jones every day and smoking my ciggy you know and if you don't know i am a very avid follower of the law of attraction because i find that it has helped me in a lot of ways in my life and just be a calmer more peaceful person overall you know so I was like, one day I was just sitting with myself and I thought to myself, how could I apply the law of attraction in cigarettes? And man oh man, this is where it all started. So I, I was sitting with myself. It was a warm summer day to the end of the summer, the first summer where I started smoking. I started smoking in May. This was like August, all right? I just sat with myself, no Jacob Jones video this day, nothing, no music. And I was just like, I'm gonna express gratitude to my cigarette so that it gives me a bigger buzz. And mind you, a big part of the law of attraction is expressing gratitude for the things that you already have. So I was like, my silly goofy mind, I was like, I'm gonna express gratitude to this cigarette. So what do I do? I'm sitting in, with myself in meditation pose. I take a hit. Well, I shouldn't have taken a hit to explain this. So I take a hit and I hold it in. And I'm right there holding the, the hit in, not breathing, just with the cigarette inside my mouth, the smoke. I inhale the hit and I just leave it there. And I'm just like, thank you world for giving me this cigarette and this great buzz. And I said this to myself like three times, but I'm standing there saying this to myself. I'm, thank you cigarette for giving me this great buzz. And after three times of saying this inside my head, I'm starting to feel a really big buzz and I'm like oh my god it is working and then I started thinking to myself a few days later why did that work why, why did why did that work you know why did it work and then I went on the internet and I researched like ways to get a bigger buzz of a cigarette and a lot of people were saying hold your breath like hold the cigarette in and I was like oh this was not the law of attraction I was just holding the cigarette in so ever since then I discovered that if you hold your your smoke you get a bigger buzz no i don't think it's because you're holding your smoke i just think it's because you're holding your breath so you're getting like kind of a head high from the lack of oxygen and then the nicotine hits at the same time and you just get a big buzz but i truly thought for a couple days that the law of attraction was working with cigarettes you know But literally, you should do it with me. I'm gonna do it right now and I'm gonna see if it works. I'm still gonna say like, thank you cigarette for this great buzz. And I, let's go, you know, you do it with me so that I don't feel goofy alone. So please like, literally do it with me, all right? I don't know what you're doing. Maybe you're not smoking. If you're not smoking, like, don't worry. Keep doing what you're doing. If you are smoking, let's do this together. So you're gonna inhale and just leave the smoke there and like say three times to yourself, thank you cigarette for this big buzz. Let's go. And the buzz, oh my God, it works. I mean, of course it works. It hits almost immediately. It's not like, I don't know if it's the cigarette buzz or if it's the stupid, stupid lack of oxygen, but it's not like I'm holding my breath for long enough. So I don't know. I like to think this works because of the grand law of the universe and expressing gratitude, but I, honestly, I don't think that's why it works. It might not work for everyone because if you have a higher tolerance to nicotine or just to holding your breath, you probably won't feel much. But I, I have a very low tolerance to both holding my breath and cigarettes so this this is just perfect for me you know but yeah i don't know i just i like thinking about those days that i spent just being like wow the law of attraction really works with cigarettes like this is amazing it works with everything and this was about the point where i was like some months in like six months in my law of attraction journey. I can talk about that. I just don't really know how to explain it very well and I'm scared that no one is gonna understand what I'm explaining about the law of attraction, but I'll do a separate video for that. 
But man, I was like, wow, what a universe. I literally can't even get a bus from the law of attraction. Amazing, you know? Anyway, I should have I should have not researched on Reddit because now I know that it's probably not because of that. And I would have liked to keep that little image in my mind that it was that that was making me have a big buzz, you know, because it's kind of goofy and funny. But yeah, I've also been on Reddit a lot on the r slash cigarette like subreddit man i love that subreddit people give such good recommendations and everyone is like really nice and they even they even talked about me like two times already they, they were like oh my god i like watching connie and i was like me like me i went to research like other connies that would do like cigarette content and there's none it's only me so i was like oh my god people are like talking about me on reddit that's kind of i i was flabbergasted by that you know i don't know i was like really thrown off not not thrown off it's thrown off like a an expression for a negative thing i didn't feel any negative emotions i was happy about it i just don't know what expression to use the only thing about Mar marlboro golds that i'm like understanding now is that i think that they smoke a little too fast or maybe i just talk too much and i let the wind eat the smoke but right now there's not really any wind so i probably am just talking too much but Man, oh man, I don't know. I was really happy when I, first of all, discovered that I can get a big buzz by holding my breath in. And I've also discovered something that is called zeroing. When you like take a lot of breaths in after you've been held instead of exhaling so that all of the smoke is getting inside your body. I feel like that's the concept of it. I need to try it. I don't know if I've ever tried that. I probably have, but I don't really remember. But I need to try like the whole zeroing a cigarette because I've heard like people get really big buzzes with that. I'm just scared of getting nicotine sick because I'm so like sensitive to nicotine sickness that I, I get nicotine sick with a stupid Marlboro gold sometimes. I don't know. I don't understand my body either, you know. Um, it's kind of annoying. Sometimes I just want to be smoking a light cigarette and if, I, if I'm smoking alone, like this happens a lot of times when I'm smoking alone, I just get nicotine sickness so many times because I'm just taking so many hits faster because I'm not talking, you know, in between taking hits that I just get nicotine sick by the end of it. And I'm like, man, we've been smoking for like almost two years. How am I still getting nicotine sick by a Marlboro Gold? My God, I don't know. But anyway, means that my tolerance is still pretty low, which I enjoy. Thank you for that body, I guess. And yeah, that was my story of how I found out that you can get a bigger buzz by holding your breath in for a little bit. At least for me it works, alright? I don't want to be telling you that it's going to work for you. Because then if it doesn't work, you're going to be mad at me. But it works for me, you know? If you are a low tolerance person, it's going to work for you as well. And either way, I hope you enjoy chilling for a little bit. And I'll be back very soon. Bye!